Okay, uh, <coughs> this is my second video uh, I'm doing about uh, Slackware, <coughs> Slackware Linux and um, the first one was the, to download the, um, the, the uh, Slackware full image, install image and uh, now uh, this video here before we do the installation to the hard drive we're gonna try the, the live editions <coughs> so this video today is about uh, Slackware um, Mate or Mate edition <coughs> so um, what we're gonna do, we're gonna try uh, each um, each uh, desktop environment they have. Right now, uh, they have uh, KDE Mate or Mate in the X XFCE desktop environment. After you install the the, the, the um, after you install the the image. To the to the hard drive, you can install a cinema desktop. Right now, I don't see a, a live image of the cinema desktop to download. But I I believe we will have one soon. But for now, this video is about uh, the Mate the Mate desktop. In the next video that I'm going to do, I'm going to do with the KDE desktop. And then the next one will be the XFCE desktop. And then whatever um, whatever desktop environment you decide to use, then I'm going to do a, a install, uh, a very easy install guide to install to the hard drive. So. But this this will be the, 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 the video after you try each version of uh, Slackware Linux. And uh, I saw that uh, on their website they, they updated the information. So I'm gonna take uh, I'm gonna uh, what I do anyway. Uh, I have a, a YouTube account, uh, Google Plus, Facebook, Twi Twitter, and I have a few blogs around. I have a, 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 um, a, um, Android app. So anyway, so um, the Android apps are automatically all the videos that I make is go if somebody has the app they're gonna have the latest uh, I at first I upload the, the video to Google Photos then I transfer to I keep a copy on Google Photos then I transfer to, to YouTube you uh, and then you can watch the video on YouTube or on the Google Photos but I put the link on Google on the YouTube because on YouTube it's easy to share the video. And then from there I I I use the blog to to I have uh, I have the blog with the video and then I have the screenshots of the installation and the step by step guide how to do the stuff. So this video is for beginners or people that have no knowledge with, with computers. So um, that's the reason why I take screenshots and uh, slowly I do that, I give that information because uh, people that already know the, the Linux, they already know how to do all this stuff. So this video is not for, for these for this people. This people for people that are new to Linux and uh, and uh, what I, <coughs> the reason why I take my time to do the videos because 
uh, nowadays the security on um, no all of the sites got uh, lots of uh, hacking happen going on so I like to show to people that there are different operating systems and there is different ways to 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 save uh, to save your data on external hard drive or USB drives. I never save anything on my computer. I save direct to external um, flash drive or USB stick, thumb drive, whatever name you want to call it, pen drive. So anyway, <coughs> the target of my videos here is to go worldwide and uh, I, I'm working in a way that when I post a video it automatically the information is translated to different languages around the globe. Anyway, so Slackware is the, is the I believe the oldest uh, Linux distribution. So it, it runs on very old hardware and the new hardware. I'm gonna I, on the video on the first video video I I have the information, but I will give a quick look at the at the Slackware the the store uh, uh, and the uh, the thing that I wanna say that any Linux distribution that you decide to use always get the 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 the, the image the the DVD or the USB stick with the with the with the with the operating system also uh, you get the, the books the tutorials um, this, you, uh, this is the way we work on, with the Linux community. So you got this is the way you support the community, and also through donations that they have on their web pages. Anyway, I, I have a I, <coughs> I have a collection of um, a huge collection of um, Linux distros, <coughs> a huge. And I like to have the name of whatever distro that I that I have. I like to have the 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 arch, the art uh, on the printed on the CD on the DVD box. I like that. And I like the magazine, the computer magazines. I love it. I like to buy the computer magazines that come with the copy of the Linux distros. So uh, I will I will give the information all about all the Linux the the Linux distros um, Linux uh, magazine that you can uh, subscribe and they can ship anywhere around the globe with the copy of the of the Linux distro they decided to sell. It's very cool. So if you want to learn about Linux. First thing is, is to get uh, subscribe to a to a, um, a Linux magazine. I will give that information at the end of this video, and on my blog, I will give the I will give the link uh, from the from Amazon.com and. Uh, uh, the other one, what the name of the, um, eBay, eBay, e yeah, eBay, uh, on the eBay website, so I'm going to give the link with all the name of the magazines, then from there you click, and then from there you can go direct to the, to the website, and from there you can sign, you can uh, uh, subscribe to it. That's the easiest way to learn, not just Linux, but any other operating system or any other, if you want to learn anything different, is 
the good thing is, is to get the stuff from the professionals that to, to do that does that. So that's what I want to say about. So anyway, smart talk. You know, let's go back here. So right now here, I, I downloaded the the old uh, the it's like where I'm made, but I want to download the game because I want to show um, down the mall is a um, is a um, add-on for for Firefox that you, that you can is a download manager plus it's verify the MD5 shell one. Chat uh, 256, Chat uh, 384, and Chat 512. I will show that on the video here, and I'm gonna zoom the, the image. I'm gonna zoom the image when it's doing that. So, <coughs> this, I'm using a slow internet connection. So that's the reason why you should use uh, right now I don't see the the torrents uh, listed on the Slackware website so usually I like to use the torrents but anyway if there is no torrents we will use the 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 we use down them all to, to download that is the download manager and I have no problem at all using it I use it for a very long time Anyway, so this is the, they upgraded the information here on the website here. Okay, I will, I will have on my blog, I will have all the links. I have a, I'm going to take a screenshot here just to show something. You got to learn how to use Firefox because Firefox is one of the best web browsers. You got to bookmark. All the links about the uh, about uh, about uh, Slackware Linux because it's going to be easy for you to jump in to any information that you want to have. So anyway, I got everything bookmarked here, and I will have that on my blog. On YouTube, I like to put the description on the on the um, on the video description. But you, there's uh, there's no uh, there's not a lot of space there to put that information. So I'm putting just the the specs, just an introduction about the what it is, and the, the specs, and then uh, I put the link of the my blog, and from there I I I use the information from from the website here then you know uh, you know everything about it so Patrick Volk Volkerdin is the one behind the the, the Slackware but anyway you watch the first video that has all the information so what we're gonna do here we need to download if you if the um, on the first video I show how to download that information but I'm gonna do it again you go here get slack like I said you can buy the stuff direct from from the website here store slackware.com can get the CDs, the DVDs, the books, 
software, books, plus uh, cap, other other stuff you can get. It. Anyway, I you get my uh, once I in, I have everything in place. But anyway, <coughs> if you if you watching this video here, you didn't watch the first one. The thing that you need to get for the live one, you go here to click here. Our mirrors. Then you go here to uh, available mirrors here. You select for the live one. For the live one, you have to select. You have to go back here. The live one is right here. See here. This is the live one here. But there is more here. There's, there's a bunch. Uh, let me see. Here. This is the page here. But uh, since they recommend on the on the main page here, they recommend to use the, the first one on the top there. That's, I'm gonna use that. But before you do that, if uh, you watching this video for the first time, I suggest you to go to to go here first. I'm gonna create. You save everything on the download folder. But I'm gonna save on different location on my computer because I'm running my operating system direct from a 16 gigabyte USB 2.0 uh, uh, USB stick. So on my <coughs> I don't have space right now on my download folder. So I'm using another flash drive here. So I'm gonna create a folder here which is going to be you don't need to do that slack where slack where wait so I'm going to save everything in this folder here so, so if it's the first time you download this info, the, this this um, you're watching this video here and you want to try the, the the mate or the mate you click it. there is a the 32 bit and 64 bit uh, the 32 bit uh, is this is a 32 bit here to beat I'm I'm <coughs> my computer is all I'm gonna test I will download the, the 32 bit but right now I want to download the 64 bit here so you click on the 64 bit or 32 bit if you have a old uh, really old computer uh, like the last 10 years you should download the 32 bit which is this one here, this is the latest one. Click here on Slackware 14.2, 64 means 64 bit. Then you're going to download. You can download the GPG key here, but you don't, you don't need to do that. We can download this lack where how to here. To 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 save this, you just I'm just gonna take a screenshot to show how you do that here. Just right click, 
and select Save Page As. So I'm going to right click, Save Page As. Then you're going to select Downloads. This is the download folder on Windows computer too. So. Anyway, so I'm going to go to my flash drive here. Then I have my folder here. But they're going to save on downloads. I'm going to save on my folder that I created here. I'm going to save the how to. So you can print that out when you be ready to do the installation. Make it easier. And then uh, you're going to download if it's a new computer, uh, the computer that came with the Windows 8 and the Windows 10, you might need this information here. I'm going to download the GPG key here, but on this video here, you're not going to need to use it. What you have to do is save pages. We're not, not going to use that. Okay, and then we're going to download the UFI here. Those, this will give all the information. I will have this on my blog once I finish the all the all the <coughs> the, the live install the live boot disks then I will have the do the install and then I will uh, I will show um, how easy easily is to install it through hard drive. So save page as Now that you do you did that, I'm gonna save this information. I'm gonna say we're gonna I'm gonna bookmark this here. Was like where here. Yeah. Then I'm gonna control A. In the first video, I have all this information here.
one you don't need because you already have the pretty much as we've seen to this like where how to here has the information so anyway this way you're gonna get this I did the control already uh, yeah. You choose which one you want to do it. Okay, so what we're going to do now, I'm going to head over to Slackware here. It's already list the, the, the light this way. Okay, so use the, the make it easy, use the, the fourteen that two live. Okay, uh, if you're new to Firefox, anyway, to install add-ons on Firefox, just click here and click uh, add-ons. Scroll down to the bottom, see more add-ons. Click on most popular here. You just can copy and paste here, but I don't know. Just click here. Down the mall.
Okay, so to install the download all you just have to do is click here, add Firefox. I'm gonna click. Uh, Screenshot, but you just have to do is click at Firefox. All right, so you have that. Now we're gonna do. We wanna to download that. So we're gonna going back here to this folder. Then we're gonna click Slack West sixty four live. Okay, they give you information here. <coughs> you always you should uh, you should uh, when you boot the the, the live disk, uh, you type live, and then the password will be live. Uh, if you're gonna install any application, you use this the su or the su command. I'm going to copy this information here to make it easier. the dot ASC save page as So save page as I'm gonna save your download folder. Now you're gonna click here MD5 take a screenshot. Then we're gonna do we're gonna right click and save page as okay this is a this is a MD uh, MD5 so what we're gonna do here you copy what we're gonna do I'm gonna make it easier I'm gonna I'm gonna make it Save this to Firefox. I'm gonna open another control A here. Copy. Paste and go. Okay. I'll go back here. I have this information open here. So what I'm gonna do now is uh, the size is uh, 2.5 gigabyte, and this is gonna take uh, 
a while for me to download this here because I'm using a slow connection here. But anyway, I'm gonna do you also have to do here is click on the first you copy this information here. Copy then you click here Slackware 64 Live This, this one I see somebody else on here. Oh fuck. So no, at least in the let me see if I can Self is giving the wrong information. You know? I have to go back here. Okay, see the see that web page there does not give you the information about the I was gonna I was gonna download the wrong image for control A here Wrong information. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna email. <coughs> I'm gonna email them. That uh, is not showing the, the the image. Anyway, you it's supposed to show this information. Then delete the screenshot that I had. Here. Okay, so forty one. I'm going to have to. The cell that we're gonna use, we're gonna use this one here. This is a mistake on, on
I have to delete everything here. Fuck. Actually, I don't have to delete the. Anyway, so <coughs> you were looking for the mate of Mate desktop. So we went to download first here the the dot ASC then you're gonna save it to the download folder then what you're gonna do here you're gonna click on the let me bookmark this one here too Take a screenshot of this page so you know when you make mistakes. So this is missing. I'm gonna take a screenshot also. Man. This is a mistake they have on the website. Okay, now since we have this information here, what I want to do now is we're going to copy this information here. Then select live mate or mate. You click here on down them all. Click OK. Then what you're gonna do first? You select. Uh, you're gonna select to save on downloads. But on my computer, I'm going to save it on the Slackware folder that I created here. I'm going to click open. Now, here, I'm going to take one screenshot. What we're going to do here, we're going to select 
MD5 Beast Take another screenshot Then as you can see here Now what I have to do is just click start here In the end, we will verify the, the image. I will uh, I will show doing this. No, it's sixty four bit.
Okay, I'm going to use those all six for a bit.
Okay, uh, from the from the website there. Um, if you want to download the live image, it's only showing the 32 bit KDE desktop environment. So if you want to use the the Mate or the XFCE, I, I didn't see on the web page there. Maybe um, uh, there is no configure with the other information there, but or you send an email to, to the Slackware team and uh, I'll show them a screenshot of the video that I'm, uh, that I'm making here, that I made, <coughs> and then uh, I hope they have the the X, the X, the the mate to it to beat because a lot of, lots of people uh, likes to use the the mate desktop so I'm gonna pause the video now and I will restart uh, when the download is almost finished Okay, I'm gonna show uh, the download finish, getting finished, and uh, you are gonna show how Dynamo works, what I find in the image. It's almost finished here. I'm gonna take a screenshot. And then we'll, uh, we will uh, just have to pay attention here. Just have to pay attention in here that you're going to see uh, is what I find. Now, As you can see, it, it verify if the if the image don't, don't match, it will give you a, a warning. That's the the image uh, is the download is corrupted, and uh, you ask to de to delete and download again. Okay, so it's finished now. 
when I take a screenshot Now I'm going to show different ways to verify the image. I'll leave this on the side. First, we're going to use our online tool to verify the, the image. It's right here. Leave this open. called md5 file.com calculator very easy to use you only check in the md5 here select it uncheck this uncheck this this uncheck this uncheck this you can just drop the image here you can browse make sure you select md5 here then you just have to do is move it here once you, once you move it there it will show here
Okay, <clears throat> this is uh, how you verify online. <clears throat> I'm going to show you. I'm going to show to use the command line. You just have to do is uh, on, on, you gotta save everything on like I'll say on the <coughs> to follow this guide here you have to save everything on the on the download folder so if you save everything on download folder you just have to do type cd downloads
press enter
Okay, I'm ready to burn the seat, the DVD. Just put on the drive.
Okay, <coughs> so the next video is going to be KDE, Sakura KDE 14.2. Live DVD and live USB, and I will do uh, a video inside of the live live uh, disc. See you in the next video.